Hello everybody and welcome to my new video. In this one I want to show you the best counter weapon for the new angler robot and the best weapon setup you can use with this robot. So leave a like if you like my stuff and subscribe to my channel and let me know what do you think about this new robot and the weapon setups I will show you. Okay, here is some weapon comparison at first and in the middle there will be my setup, my setup I prefer and I will show you a little bit gameplay with this setup. So these are the best overall setups Claw and Talon, Cudgel and Hammer on place 2 and Scatter and Devastator on place 3. I prefer the second and the third place because it feels very great to play this one at the battlefield. But I put on another heavy weapon 
on this robot and I had a lot of fun with this setup. Here it is, I used the Kachel Puncher build. We tested this out in yesterday's live stream as I tested out the uh, best drone for this robot here and at first uh, I prefer the Amadillo drone or, and this is a secret tip here, I use the Whiteout drone. Uh, yeah, we don't even have the purple shield, but with the ability of this drone, the Angler is very great in my mind. And I will show you now the gameplay and what we can do with this setup. I started with the Angler robot here into this round, and we have here a Orochi and a Kibri against us. And we all know that this Scatter Kibri is definitely yeah a beast at the battlefield and here with the ability we got the orochi down and now let's try to get this keep your robot down with the whiteout drone you know it and the golden ships you will get 160 defense points while repairing what is very great to have and yeah, in combination with the ability of the Engner robot here and uh, yeah, suppress the enemy like in this case here, we can do very great things. Let's put on the ability again. And this keeper is very strong, but together with my teammates, we got him. And another great thing I think is the uh, Northlight mothership with the durability extender that makes the Agnet to a decent beast with a lot of firepower and in combination with all the abilities you can play it very well so yeah thanks to my subscribers and watchers from yesterday's stream because they said um, yeah put on a puncher on this robot in combination with the shotguns and yeah for sure it works very well and is powerful Let's try to get this beacon here. I noticed, okay, there are only two, but um, there are HP monsters. We have the Kibri and the Fenrir. And then I noticed, oh my goodness, four robots, can we beat them? Um, and I don't think so. So let's call the mothership here in this case to get another defense. And now use my ability to run away at first because um, yeah I noticed I can't get all of them down. Let's try to start with one of those with the keeper here. And I still have a decent amount of HP here with this build. And in the end we got this keeper down. Now let's go to the Revenant here to capture back the uh, middle beacon of this map and look at the damage that is so impressive pressing the ability button and again we can get him down so let me know what do you think about this build maybe you have another great build for the angler uh, which you want to use then let me know this write down something in the comments and uh, yeah we can talk about this or join my discord server in this case the ability damage is now very nice here Let's try to get this Fenrir down. We got the beacon back. Crazy. The enemy can't do any more so much damage to this robot because of all these defense points. And now let's try to get another Fenrir build down here. Okay, that takes a little bit. But it all, with my teammate, we got him down, and that was great. And the Seraph, with my teammate, we got him down too. So, we still have the 150,000 HP on this robot. If you noticed uh, my health bar. And now it's time to capture another beacon, because I want to win this round here. And we are still after 4 minutes in our robot. So here we go, capturing the beacon, the Seraph is in the air. So get another defense point here from the spaceship and go for the Seraph and do some damage to him. Let's go! Boom! Gone! So now 
something great happen, um, you have to watch a little bit. Um, there's a Titan and another Titan. We have a Luchador and a Muromets. Can I beat them or can I do a decent amount of damage to these ones? Let's see. And yeah, for those who didn't do this before, please leave a like here under this one. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell. Then you never will miss any of those videos. And look at the Luchador's HP here. With a teammate, I think we can get this Titan down. But in this case here, I was only alone. But I think I can give you here a great example how good this robot can be with the right setup. Bye bye everyone. Have a wonderful day and good luck in the game. I really wanted to get it right. Trying to find some balance in my life. I never really put up a fight. And now I'm losing sleep.